action. So welcome back to the channel. My name is Angel Menendez and the first thing that I want to tell you guys is um, thank you so much and especially to Snyder Olier Oler <laughs> maybe I, sorry for butchering your your name <laughs> but um, also Thomas then Freddy then Joe DJ thank you so much dude then Doogie and also Omniel so guys um, really thank you so much I know that last video was um, kind of like different as normal and reason why is that we go through things uh, you know sometimes that make us you know go and make us like you know suffer and stuff like that and it's part of life and it's not what I want to portray on my channel uh, all the time but when it happens I need to do it because it's reality and this channel as I mentioned to you before has been everything about you know my real life everything my struggles and everything so thank you so much guys for the you know the support the you know going the extra mile and you know and caring not everyone does that and I really really thank you for that now let's talk about something real quick and it is uh, you know you keep a lot to yourself because there is not much people that you know that listen to that reason why that happens is uh you know and it is sad is that in today's day we don't care about anything besides ourselves so when you see that and you start like keeping to yourself a lot of things and you start like um you know suffering from the inside out is something that is that is you know it's not productive and it is like really bad it is really really bad and I was like that for like all this time and now I'm doing something I'm gonna change all this because if I keep doing the same thing there is not best definition of insanity than you know repeat doing the same thing with the same outcome so we need to change that up now it's super important to notice that um you know it's not it's gonna be like a bumpy ride but it's a bumpy ride that we're gonna take to her and hopefully you're not going through the same thing that i'm going and but if you do uh just you know stay in tune and we're gonna keep you know going and you know i'm fitting off each other so the first thing that i want to tell you guys and the first thing is you know with a big smile is let's do a gym edit it's a long time that i haven't done a gym edit so bear with me if it's not with the high quality but little by little we're getting better so let's jump into this gym edit right now let's get it
So hope you enjoy the gym edit. I love it. I love it. It's uh, you know it's a good warm up to start like you know like start vlogging and everything. So I really miss my gym. By the way, I have to show you guys the you know the gym that I have um, made for myself until all this craziness goes away. Now that's gonna be another video that I actually record the video already, but I have to you know speak over. Now let's talk about something super important on this uh, you know on this chapter of my life, like dealing with this depression that I had uh, you know for all this time and still have. But it's, you know, it's getting better. Now, let me tell you some of the ways that I have found to, you know, to start overcoming this problem. The first way that I start finding to overcome of this problem is, number one, start finding a reason why. Like something bigger than yourself, something that you are doing for someone else. And that is going to help you a lot, you know distracting yourself from falling into thinking all the things that you normally do when you're depressed. So if you find a reason why, and my reason why is you guys, it's YouTube, it's my whole mission with this channel, as you know, if you are an old uh, you know, follower of the channel, but if you're not, it's to inspire a lot of people to do their best and become the person that I never had for myself. So that's, you know, that's my vision. My mission and everything on this channel is pointing towards that. And everything that I do is point towards that. And that's, you know, that's the way that I'm gonna be approaching all this, like thinking in everything that I'm building and, you know, I'm working towards and little by little getting to, you know, to get in the best way possible to inspire as many people as possible. So the next one is gonna be finding some goals that give you sense of you know accomplishment. So finding something that distracts you, something that you know makes you like drive. For example, right now I'm here in my house, like I'm barely going out. Um, and what can I do with that? The first thing is, you know, start working and learning more of my editing and my YouTube and everything for the channel. The other thing is gonna be like, you know, building. I have all the equipment that I need to build like a really good fix it. And you know, and it's gonna be something so good to distract me, to like, you know, work towards something and improve my diet and try new things and, you know, and create new ideas for the channel and everything. So those goals, like losing weight and getting in a better shape. And I'm right now in an environment that I can control besides like going a lot out to restaurants and stuff like that, I cannot control that much. But being here, I have more control. So I'm gonna take advantage of all that to get a better physique, get, you know, more healthy. Also work towards my YouTube channel and towards doing a lot of, you know, editing and stuff like that. And learning new tricks. That's something that I really love to do. And also, you know, creating new content. It's a, it's a challenge and I'm taking it. So. That's number two. Another important step is getting on my head that what happens today or what is, has been happening is not gonna happen forever. So we have to overcome that. So I have to overcome everything that I have been seeing, all this craziness going on around. I have to know that it's not gonna be forever. So I have to live on the moment live on the time and then good things will arrive so something that i used to love a lot was playing guitar and i got so busy that i you know i stopped playing for a longest time ever and i haven't picked it up and it, it, it brings me back for you know like so good memories like when i had a band on cuba and we were playing in several places and it was amazing, it was a huge part of my life that completely, like, you know, disappeared. And all because of other priorities that came along and I, I stopped playing it. 
And what better moment right now that I'm always on the house and everything to slight, start like picking up and playing it. By the way, that's mine. I did it a, a long time ago. So, what a best way to do this. Like, I'm already happy by playing that. So, let's wrap this up. It's a long, I don't know if it's a long video or something like that, but thank you guys so much, especially to the people that commented. And man, I'm happy already. Thank you so much. Let's keep killing it. Sin estrés, muéstrame sus pasos, te cuento hasta diez y ven. Yo sé que tú quieres. Vamos un, dos, tres. Sin estrés, muéstrame sus pasos, te cuento hasta diez y ven. Yo sé que tú quieres. Sé que tú 